Hello YouTube, this is Cesco from STEM APKs. Uh, welcome to our fifth tutorial. This tutorial we'll be talking about the flood fill uh, algorithm, sometimes also called as the boundary fill or the seed fill. And this is the algorithm, as you can see here in the animation, it's a Wikipedia page that a lot of uh, paint programs use as part of their um, their bucket, where uh, you just it's almost like uh, dropping a bucket of paint and it will just flood the plane and uh, that's where it gets its name and as you can see uh, it, it, it does it sometimes it does it every four uh, contiguous uh, squares sometimes it does it every eight in this case it's, uh, it's every eight squares and so it, it works a lot uh, a little bit faster than when it's uh, the four squares uh, but there's um, there's a, a lot of cool stuff that you can do with this algorithm. Um, I this is this code right here. This is a, a small code piece of code just to give you an, an example. Uh, what I did here was uh, I took the, um, imported the image package from the Python image library, NumPy, PyLab, import the computer visions. I read an image, uh, which I will be showing you. It's called Pick Three. Im read it. Um, read the file name, which would be here. Print the height, the width. Then do the flood fill algorithm that is part of the computer vision. And I, I'm using 145 and 255 and zero on the other one. And uh, what I'm going to do is uh, open a, a, a window called flood fill image. And uh, I'm going also to save the result. Okay, so let's get started. What was what I'm going to do here? Um, I, I took this code, as you can see, let me show you. This code comes with your computer vision is one of the examples. And as you can see, this is the whole uh, demo that they use to give you an idea of how it works and I will be showing you this it's, it's done they, it picks a color randomly and um, it's a, the RGB red green and blue and what it does is that it, it runs down yeah, where is it so, right here it takes um, uh, an image and then it picks the image and you, you, you use the, your mouse to pick an area and as long as it's connected it will connect all, all the squares that are connected like the animation in the Wikipedia file so what I did here was use uh, a small piece of code I think was involved was this one but I'll be showing you how they both work and um, Right, let's show you. Control, let me get out of here. Control X. Let's Python four pi. And this will be the image. The original image looks like this. This is what the uh, original image looks like. and this is after I, I dumped the bucket and um, I, I will be using this is using this little code that I that I had here uh, that I just show you it's, uh, you get, it's up here but I'm gonna show you uh, the same uh, code that but the one that they use expanded and um, it has some cool effects. Let's show you. Let me close these. And go to the sample folder. See. And, and CBE Python. 
and this is the the um, the file right here f flood field demo and I will be running that one flood field demo oops wrong one f flood field demo with the picture the same picture that I use png C. C. And there it goes. And as you can see, this is the image that I showed you earlier. But now this is the, it has these lighters with that, that uh, OpenCV. Um, it comes with, the, with that sample, with that demo. And, and you, let's say you flood the plane with these um, with random colors as you can see and as long as it's um, it, it won't go over the boundaries so as you can see here it will the color will be contained within the boundaries and it's uh, it's really nice it's a really nice algorithm And it will keep coming up with no colors, and you can change the with this lighter. You can go increase or decrease. Okay, and there's another one that I wanted to show you. Uh, let me show you this one. Close this one and get, let's get out of here. To the other one, Python. Oops, wrong one. Python two. That's the one I want. And let me run this one. Python. This is one that I, I, I get this picture at uh, for Halloween. Halloween is coming up soon, and uh, it, this is one of, of the things that you can do with this algorithm. As long as the pixels are connected uh, with the use of my mouse, just like I did with the pictures picking colors, what I'm going to do is pick certain areas. And as long as they're connected, it, it, it will connect. As you can see, I'm hitting different areas. And there's some things that you could do that are, are really cool and are very appropriate for Halloween coming. And it can get uh, really great special effects. And that's just the algorithm running and the use of your mouse connecting different areas of the of the image. And as long as it's contiguous and continuous and there's not any boundaries, everything is connected, it will keep creating these great special effects. And this is the end of the tutorial. Uh, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please click the like box and subscribe. And I will be seeing you in the next tutorial. Have a great day.